Hello and welcome to the Minecraft survival series we're doing. We're following Captain Sparkles. Um, I am going to start today. It's kind of a boring episode. I don't know if it's going to be long or short. I'm going to try to break it up into like three different parts. Um, the first part is me running all over the land up here while it's daylight trying to get some resources. And then the second part is going to be mining down to bedrock going straight down. And then the third part is hopefully finding some diamonds and making a turtle and getting it going. That's the plan for the day. Um, the resources at the top, I will stop at the end and show you what I get. And the mining, I'll show you what I did. And then we'll break it up into series and a little bit of everything. I don't want to sit here and just go around and chop down trees and show you how wonderful it is to chop down trees. Um, it does, talking about chopping down trees, this does have a great uh, pack in it. I can't think what you call it right now, but basically you get an axe and you chop down the bottom log and all the whole tree comes down, which is really cool. Makes it a lot easier. Takes a minute to chop down that bottom log, but it's, it's a lot fun. All right, so I am going to explore this little island or whatever I'm on right now and try to get some resources above land when the night falls. I will start digging down. Um, I will get back with you in just a moment. Okay, this is what I got so far. Above, I've got a lot of wood. I'm going to use that for uh, digging my way out of my mine that I'm going to dig all the way down the bed grot. I got uh, clay, which I'm going to use to make bricks, which we're going to make a coke coal oven. So we can make our coal a little bit stronger at the beginning. Um, it's just a beginning fuel. I found some rubies, which will make great pick later. Um, what else I get? I got a lot of wood, basically, and got the clay and got um, some sand. I probably need some more sand, so we'll probably have to go up and get that. The only thing I couldn't find that I really wish I had was uh, I got some food also. Um, was an ink sack. I can't seem to get the uh, squid to spawn for some reason. I don't know if it's uh, the one of the mods here that's messing with it or if they're just really hard to spawn. I'm not really sure. So the next part here is I'm going to dig straight down to the bedrock and then we will start a little area down there to start strip mining. So I will show you when I get there. Okay, I've dug all the way down to bedrock right there and I'm all the way up to the ceiling there. I got my ladder. Uh, set up a little spot here. I have a place that I can sleep. I've already got that slept once. Um, the big thing is we're going to start mining. We're on level 12 right now. Um, this is the stuff that I got at the top basically and a few things on the way down. Uh, there we go. We're just going to start strip mining. The big key here is I want three diamonds. Once I find three diamonds we can start automating a little bit. I need to find some more coal and I need to find some more um, iron. That's my keys right now. Uh, I don't know if I'm going to find much coal here. I might have to start making my own. So we'll see what happens. We are going to just start digging and once I get a good mine going I will break in again and show you what happens. Um, about a little bit about this mod pack. I'm having some difficulties. It keeps crashing on me. I hope to keep using it. Uh, I just sent in a um, crash report to the guy that's created the mod pack. So hopefully it'll help a little bit. Um, it's just frustrating. All of a sudden it'll just crash and sometimes it won't let me open the world back up. I've had to create this twice now. Um, right now this is, I haven't had this one crash. I just started from scratch on this one. Um, so I got my fingers crossed. I'm doing a lot of saves as I go. So if you're doing it you might want to save your worlds and do a few backups as you go. Alright here we go. I will uh, be back in a minute. Cool. 
my time. Alright, I believe we're on our last part of this video. Um, I am going to build a few things, put everything together. A coke coal oven, a turtle, and a few pipes and chests to get stuff out of the turtle or to try to sort it. Um, unfortunately, I can't find a freaking squid. Um, I need that to make a void pipe. Um, I like to transfer everything from one chest to another chest and in the process get rid of all the extra cobblestone and dirt and gravel and stuff I usually don't use much. Um, I can generate that stuff if I really need it. Um, but I can't find a freaking squid to make a void pipe. So we'll set it all up for the void pipe um, and without the diamond pipe which sorts it. We'll save that and, uh, and we'll go from there. We'll do it as soon as we can find it. But for now, I just go ahead and I want to, first off, I want to make a coke coal oven. Um, that I don't have much coal. I got 16. So I want to make sure we use as much as we can. Um, to make a coke coal oven, I need coke coals. Let's go ahead. And that's right here. And that's our recipe. Blocks. I see I need 9 plus 9 plus 8. I need 26 altogether, so I need another 10. Six coke coal blocks. Got a place to put them right here, and it's just nine by nine. And the wood won't do it, will it? That wasn't too smart. All right, let's try doing the right stuff this time. Coke coal, where are you? There you are. Looks like wood. In my defense. Show you the difference that it makes in the energy output. It's basically a hollow center, and there it is. And let's get my coal. Out. I can't believe all the coal I found. And I'm gonna put it inside here. I'm gonna need a void pipe also to get off the creosote oil. Um, I don't think there wasn't a, a use for it in the last few episodes, but we'll see. All right, it's lagging on me here. Come on, get it out, there you go. So now my coke, my coal is turning into coke coal. In the meanwhile, let's go ahead and make a turtle. Um, let's hang this up a little bit. Turtle has a piston inside. And turtles are really cool. Now the difference between a turtle and a quarry is, um, there's a couple of things. The turtle, can feed itself. If there, if it runs into coal, it saves it and it uses it for energy. Where the quarry, you have to continuously feed it and create support behind it, as you've probably seen on Captain Sparkles. Um, try to get this going. The thing about the turtle, though, is if you leave your game, it stops. both. I have to give credit to the guys on YouTube that can do both at the same time. Um, here's my computer. And then, da, 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 da. There's my turtle. Pick 
for it. Now we got a mining turtle. And you so say, what do we need to make after the redstone engine? But real quick, okay. Turtle, you can't leave. You, you can leave it on a server that's running all the time as long as you have a chicken chunk loader. And I'll show you about those later. Um, but on a regular game, you might turn off. If you turn it off while the turtle's running, it will stop and you have to restart it where it stopped or you restart it from the very beginning. Um, the query will keep on going, which that's a good thing, but it just takes a lot more resources. So the beginning of the game, I think the best thing to use is a turtle, not a query. Once we get our resources going, then we'll start talking about using a uh, query. Okay, let's go ahead and build the redstone engine. I'll show you what that's used for in just a minute. Get this stuff out of the way. I keep hitting something at source. I need to look at the options. This is everything else I'm going to need along the way. That's for my pipes. Okay. So let's go ahead and build a lever real quick. Why does it keep sorting on me? I gotta figure that out. There's that. And then I need a piston. Where'd my cobble go? There it is. Wood. That's that. A piece of glass. More wood. I'm going to bring it all back because I forgot to make the gears. There's the gear stuff. So I'm going to go up level 6, up a few levels, because I'm trying to get everything in the diamond area for now. And we're going to put the turtle down right here. The most most important thing to do on your new turtle is you need to set the label. So label, set my turtle. Sound good? Computer label set to my turtle. Then we need some energy. Let's see if any of the coke coal is done. Good. Get three of them. Let me show you the difference here. This has 4K at 10K. at 10 EUs, right? 4 EUs at 10 EUs. This has 8K at 10 EUs. So it's 8K compared to 4K. So it doubles the energy. And that was just good. And creosol was used for a while as a biofuel, but I got rid of that. I think that's part of Greg Tech, so we'll see what happens. We're going to go ahead and put that in there, and we're going to do refuel. And you'll see it takes one out, so it's refueled and taking one out. Or you can do refuel all. Now that leaves this slot here extra open, so if it runs into coal, it'll start filling it up with coal. That's why we go ahead and refuel it all the way. All right, now we're going to excavate a square. 20 by 20, so excavate 20, and there it goes. I get the keyboard out of the way. There it goes. That's going to go tw down 20, go over 20, come back 20, and then just make a big square and go all the way down the bedrock. It's going to dump its contents right here in this chest, and I want to put two, another chest over here. Come on. All right. Make some 
piping real quick. We need wood piping. Where's my wood? There's my wood. One, two. And let's make some cobblestone piping. And again, we need that void pipe and uh, well, my escape key is not working well. I need a new keyboard. Uh, void pipe and diamond pipe later. So for now, we are going Take the wood out of this one. So you have to take the stuff out of this one. You have to use a wood pipe to take things out. You have to hit shift, shift, not shift. And there's my cobblestone. And then we're going to put an engine, redstone engine on this with a lever. So the, the theory is that the turtle will dump everything in right here, and then it'll carry it over onto this one here. And in the middle, we're going to put a diamond pipe later with a void pipe coming off that will eliminate cobblestone and gravel and any dirt and anything we don't need. All right, we will end this episode here. We will come back and start the next episode and see what we've gotten. I'm going to basically AFK here and watch the turtle and maybe light it up a little bit. There will be a lot of mods in here soon. I could technically leave, but I don't have a chunk loader, so I can't go too far. With This chunk has to stay loaded. So I'm just going to go AFK just for now and uh, set up for the next episode. I hope this episode has helped a lot. If you have any questions, go ahead and leave them in the comments below. Um, favorites always helps. Make sure everyone else can see it. Um, hey, and have a great day, guys.